What's up, Internet? Today, we're gonna be talking about the best mobile internet provider. Sino ba yung mas okay? Globe or Smart? Para makuha natin yung sagot, umikot kami sa walong lugar sa Metro Manila. And we didn't just test in different places, we tested in different heights as well. Umakit kami sa 8th floor, umakit kami sa 42nd floor. We tested it at different heights just to get a sense of the regular user whose experience will change depending if he's at ground level, whether he goes up five flights or things like that. So we tried to test it not just in geographically different locations, but to test for elevation difference as well. And so if you're wondering who won, hands down, Smart won. It won six out of the eight locations where we tested. And the two locations where Globe won, where San Masabilis si Globe, Actually, yung isang location, medyo pantay lang sila eh. Medyo parehas lang si Smart at si Globe. Six out of eight tested spots, Smart won. And not only did it win, it won in very convincing fashion. Sobrang bilis nung Smart kumpara sa Globe. To be honest, I'm biased. I wanted Globe to win because I'm not a big believer in PLDT, which is basically the same company as Smart. I think PLDT customer service is terrible, terrible, the worst that you can get. I really thought Smart would lose because Globe is the underdog, Globe tries harder. But, you know, the data doesn't lie. Let's break down the data if you want a more detailed explanation of how we reached that verdict. For the Globe tests, we ran all of them on the same cell phone, a OnePlus 5T. Para sa smart tests, lahat ng smart tests, ginamit namin yung same cell phone, the Galaxy S10 Plus. So both of these phones, the OnePlus and the Samsung, are basically top of the line or you know, there aren't any differences in the speed because of the model used. Any differences in speed come from the differences in the provider, whether it's Globe or Smart. We try to keep all of the variables as constant as possible only changing the location and the service provider. The app we use to test the internet speeds is called Meteor and pinili ko si Meteor because malinaw yung data na binibigay niya sa'yo. It gives you the download speed, the upload speed, and the ping. And it also tells you the performance of several popular applications. Maganda ba to for Facebook? Maganda ba siya for YouTube? Okay ba yung Gmail dito? Okay ba yung Netflix dito? Meteor can tell you all of those things in a very simple and easy to use interface. That's why we used it for these tests. So let's break down the data for the eight tests. Manila, Luxon Ave, near USD. In Manila, Smart One, it had a download rate of 10.6 Mbps. Smart Upload was a whopping 17 Mbps and ping was very good at 34 milliseconds. Compared to Globe, 7.5 download speed. So Smart was roughly 40% maybe faster than Globe. Smart's upload speed was ridiculous. 17 Mbps compared to just 1 Mbps from Globe. So hands down, much better upload speed from, Mani from Smart in Manila. And Globe's ping was also higher and that's a bad thing at 52 milliseconds. Quezon City near Quezon Ave. In Quezon City where we tested, this was a win for Smart but because basically Globe had a dead spot. We could not get any internet signal for Globe in the location where we tested. This was near Quezon Ave, basically just behind Quezon Ave. And we couldn't get a we couldn't get a signal from Globe. So all of the Globe stats for this test are zero. Zero download, zero upload, and zero ping. And I thought that Smart would be bad since Globe had no signal, basically. But as it turned out, Smart was very good. It had 12.2 Mbps for download, 4.6 for upload, and a very respectable 27 milliseconds for ping. So again, I can't emphasize this enough. In one spot where Globe had zero coverage, sorry ka na lang, kawawa ka na lang kung Globe gamit mo dun sa spot where we tested sa QC, sobrang okay naman yung Smart. And so that's, again, a very clear win for Smart in that area. Condo in Salcedo, Makati. In Makati, we tested on the 42nd floor. This is a condominium building in Salcedo. Globe gave decent speeds, but Smart, again, was the very clear hands-down winner. Smart had 14.7 Mbps download, 11.9 Mbps upload, and very respectable 
34 milliseconds ping, Globe was just much slower compared to Smart. Globe had 4.1 Mbps download, 1.6 upload, and 87 milliseconds of ping. And again, the results are so, you know, the, the gap between them is just so large. Again, Smart is the hands down winner. Gas station on SLEX near Laguna. SLEX, uh, we tested in a gas station in SLEX in Laguna. And this is the only location where Globe was the definite winner. And actually, I was even surprised na nakahanap kami ng isang location na nanalo talaga si Globe. And Smart was really bad in this area, I don't know, for some reason in this gas station. Smart download rate was 137 kbps. That's not, that's not mbps, that's kilobytes per second. Smart upload was 646 kbps. So both measurements didn't even reach a megabyte. And ping was 36 milliseconds. Globe speeds were, you know, decent. Not bad. 4.9 Mbps for download, 4.6 Mbps for upload, and 34 milliseconds ping. So, decent speeds from Globe, but the takeaway from this clear win is that, at least in that spot, Smart just didn't have the coverage. Um, I don't quite understand, actually. I was really surprised to get this. I guess this just really shows that even with large networks like Globe and Smart, there are still some spots, even relatively close to Metro Manila, where the coverage is not so good. At St. Luke's Taguig. I tested on the 8th floor of St. Luke's Taguig, and this is the closest spot we tested to the Globe headquarters, which is located in BGC. Katabi mo lang yung Globe headquarters, isipin mo baka manalo pa si Globe dito. But again, Smart won. No contest. Smart was a monster when it came to this location. Download speeds of 74, 75 Mbps. Upload speed of 23 Mbps and ping of 39. And compared to the very anemic speed of Globe, which was 2 Mbps download, 14, not too bad, 14 Mbps upload and 19 millisecond ping. But yun nga, katabi mo na nga yung Globe headquarters and talo pa rin ni Smart si Globe. So, another clear win for Smart. In Tagaytay. Smart wins in this one. To be fair, the Globe speeds were not bad. But, but again, Smart is much faster compared to Globe. Smart in Tagaytay had 40.4 Mbps download, 10 Mbps upload, and 43 ping uh, 43 milliseconds for ping. Globe had a very decent 26 Mbps, but still very far behind the 40 Mbps download speed of Smart. And the upload speeds were basically the same. Smart had 8.3 Mbps. Outside Fort Bonifacio. In BGC again, we tested near one of the office buildings and Globe wins here in terms of speed, but both providers had good speeds here. So, you know, it's kind of hard to compare. You know, I mean, yes, Globe wins, but either provider would have been okay in this location. Globe wins with 33 Mbps download, 10.5 Mbps upload, and 22 millisecond ping. Smart actually is quite close behind with 28 Mbps for download, 4.6 for upload, and 23, again, basically the same ping at 23 milliseconds. We tested also in Alabang on the 8th floor of Asian Hospital. And again, Smart just destroyed Globe. Globe had trouble getting signal or Globe had a very weak signal here compared to the, again, superior performance of Smart. So in a nutshell, 6 out of 8 times, talo ni Smart si Globe. Again, I wanted Globe to win, but if I had to get a postpaid plan now, and I specifically, yung concern ko, yung mobile data ko, ano yung pinakamabilis, sino yung pinaka, sino yung may okay na coverage, sino yung medyo sigurado ako kung iikot ako sa Metro Manila, mabilis pa naman yung internet, I gotta tell you, hands down, Smart is the winner. Even though I still hate PLDT, I, I can't help it, but again, you know, Smart for mobile data, so I hope that these basic tips helped you. If you found this video helpful, please drop a like and hit the subscribe button. For your PC needs, consider buying from us, Hardware Sugar, at Lazada, or on our website. You can find links in the description below. And thank you for watching. See you next video.